Tasmania has a long and proud history of advanced manufacturing, innovation and continuous improvement. Uh, and PFG are a world leading manufacturer of next generation high density polyethylene uh, watercraft. Uh, already, uh, TAS Police uses uh, five of those uh, uh, vessels. Uh, we have other vessels in service with inland fisheries. Uh, but this is cutting edge, world leading. And we know that, um, that PFG, um, in terms of the work that it does and the product that it provides, it is renowned around the world. Now, importantly, the advanced manufacturing sector in Tasmania has long been recognised uh, for its quality. Uh, and importantly, as a government, uh, we want to encourage growth. Uh, we want to encourage uh, the development of this very important sector. Now, today I'm very pleased to be here because we're going to back uh, this company uh, with an interest-free loan of $600,000 secured um, over the period uh, to start construction of an 11-metre prototype boat. This will help secure the operations at PFG, locking in employment of around 40 PFG uh, employees and obviously ensuring that there's continuous um, flow-on benefits for uh, local businesses through the construction of this prototype vessel. And Rob will say more about that um, shortly. Importantly, the prototype will help PFG compete for new tenders by allowing them to demonstrate exactly what their product can do. Uh, as we were walking around, as Rob made the point a moment ago, um, a brochure can explain so much. You can uh, be a very gifted salesperson and outline what your product will do. But if you can touch it, if you can feel it, if you can drive it in the water, uh, then that speaks volumes. And so, in particular, uh, this prototype will be competing hard for a 20-year, $70 million build program for sea boats for the Royal Australian Navy. Now, our commitment, if we're re-elected, will allow them to compete hard for this tender, which, if they're successful, will create a number of uh, additional Tasmanian jobs, both direct and indirect, and importantly, add millions more to our economy. I can also announce that um, a re-elected majority government, Liberal government, um, will help PFG and a range of other manufacturers and businesses gain new contracts by providing a $600,000 grant program, competitive grant program, over two years for the tender incentive um, uh, program for developing grants uh, and uh, being able to uh, put forward tenders for this specialised work. So we're going to step in and assist businesses to ensure that they are able to compete against the best in the world and the best in this country. We know that tender processes are complicated, time-consuming and expensive, and we want to do all that we can to reduce these barriers and help companies bring these uh, tenders to Tasmania. This will give our advanced manufacturers the support they need to put their best foot forward uh, and ensure that when preparing tenders or seeking third-party support um, in preparing and submitting tenders for contracts, that they are backed by the government as well with this program. And eligible grant recipients will be able to put their hand up for between 10,000 uh, and 100,000 in grants to back uh, getting these tenders ready.